it was a hard fought game. Uh, I thought uh, Vandy just made enough plays at the end. And um, we didn't finish at the basket a few times. And we didn't get, get to the free throw line uh, when we drove it. And I thought that was the difference. They were able to get to the free throw line, and we weren't able to. The, uh, the press was effective for you, it seemed like, when you'd go to it. you just not have enough depth to be able to, to stick with it a lot? Or? With that and with Tyler Davis in foul trouble, um, and, and two, you, we usually set our press up off of a dead ball, of, off of a made free throw, and we didn't get to the free throw line. I thought we got fouled a number of times around the basket and just didn't finish um, or, 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 or get, get the call. But we, um, that was an example where we forced a turnover under the basket. We, we had a chance to get a layup, and we didn't finish. Say the last possession, I guess, was that the shot that you wanted? You know, not really. Trokers struggled from the three-point line all year. Um, we're, we're undermanned right now. Um, but, um, you know, he, he got an open look. I was at, wanting him to drive the ball with 17, 18 seconds because I thought he can uh, get a foul and get the clock stopped. But he, he was open. Um, but maybe he was open for a reason. You know, maybe they wanted him to be open because he's not shooting the ball well. He had a really good start there. What, what did Vanderbilt do to sort of get back into that? Well, Fisher Davis got loose a couple of times, and he got him right back in, in the game. Uh, and Tyler Davis getting in foul trouble, I, he seems to get every, every um, – Tough call, and then I don't think he, he gets enough calls. I mean, he's a big kid. He shot five free throws, and that, that's out of 18 attempts, that, that's that's hard hard for me to understand. And you got to give. Uh, I thought Cornette, his length uh, blocked some shots. He he was a big factor too. So. I missed it, but was playing just to kind of take it, Cornette, given what you guys have got and the fact that all much depth there? Well, that's how we play. You know, we, we want to get uh, the ball inside, and we, we did. We just didn't finish enough, or we, did, we didn't get them get to the free throw line. Uh, um, they had – Robeson had four fouls, and uh, Cornette, um, he only had two fouls. And, I, I mean, either he did a great job of not fouling or it just wasn't called. When they hit the freeze, and I think seven of their field goals yeah. were freeze, was that them hitting shots or you guys not getting out the shoes? I thought um, in transition, they're hard to guard because they spread the floor and they get outside the arc. And um, our transition defense wasn't great, but they make it hard because they're such a good team from the three point line. They, they drove us early, and then they started getting open threes uh, later. You mentioned the not getting to the free throw long enough, but a little frustrated uh, there, just went kind of cold there in the final four minutes. Yeah, you know, we're playing Tony Troca at the three, and he's really a four. And um, we've had to adjust that some. And, you know, we, I think we wore down, too. I thought we were tired, uh, and we need to be a little bit tougher. I thought they made more tough plays in finishing off possessions. Uh, at the end, if it's seven seconds on the shot clock, got to the end of the shot clock, they were able to shoot free throws. When we got to the end of the shot clock, we didn't we didn't get anything out of it. Bit of a homecoming for JC Hampton tonight. What has he meant to your team? Um, JC, you know, uh, has been solid for us. Uh, you know, hit hit a big three uh, tonight. Um, he's just been steady. We're very young. We've got a team full of freshmen and sophomores. I think we have 13 freshmen and sophomores. So adding a senior who's, who's been coached by a very good coach uh, at Lipscomb, um, was, it was important for us to bring his experience in.